you can create and build Cobra applications that target .NET 6. Just like c -sharp, you can open Visual Studio, create a new project and select the .NET 6 console app template. From here, you can then start writing new code or import existing programs into your project. Because we are targeting .NET 6, we can call any API that is available in the .NET framework directly from our COBOL program. This also includes any NuGet package that supports .NET 6. For example, you can use the NuGet package manager to import a YAML library into your project and then use it exactly as if you were writing in c -sharp. This allows you to easily modernize your COBOL application by applying small code modifications to enable newer technologies. Debugging is also supported. This includes viewing the call stack, threads, memory usage, the value of data items, and a lot more. You can modify data as the program is running, step through the code, and use breakpoints to suspend the program at certain points. In Visual Studio 2022, two new types of breakpoint have been introduced. These include temporary and dependent breakpoints. When you are ready to ship your application, you can use Visual Studio's Publish Wizard to configure how you would like to deploy your application. With .NET 6, you can choose whether to publish your application with or without the .NET 6 runtime and the platform and architecture it should target. There are additional options for configuring the size and form of your application. Once you are happy with your published profile, you can publish your application, which will build it and copy the final output to the publish output directory. Self-contained .NET 6 applications are portable and do not require a pre-installation of .NET. You can simply zip up your application and copy it to the machine or container you would like to run the application on. You can also publish applications via the command line. Again, you can copy your application files to the target machine, such as this Ubuntu VM, and run it like any other executable. Alongside our support for Visual Studio 2022, we also have an extension for Visual Studio Code. This can be downloaded from the VS Code public gallery on both Windows and Linux. You can develop your .NET 6 Cobra application using the .NET CLI, just like you would with other .NET languages. VS Code provides an integrated terminal where you can run these .NET CLI commands, but you can alternatively create custom build tasks and debug profiles which call the same commands for you. Here we have an ASP.NET Core application written in C-sharp, but the business logic is a legacy Cobra application wrapped by another project which performs the data conversions between native .NET types and COBOL data types. We can debug the application and step through the C-sharp code, but then also seamlessly step into the COBOL code. We still have all the essential features such as viewing the call stack and inspecting data items. Being able to build and debug .NET COBOL on Linux has many advantages. For example, you could use Visual Studio 2022's rich editing features and templates to build your .NET COBOL app. Then use VS Code on Linux to edit, test and debug your application on the target platform.